What's up, I'm Kai, and this is exactly how I earned $158,274 in three months, charging $10,000 to $30,000 fees up front with less than 500 followers. I did this without referrals, inbound leads, competing on price, guarantees, or any irresistible offers, no gimmicks, no hacks. This is strictly for agency owners, freelancers, and B2B service providers. So let's just break it down real quick. So references available here. Uh, this figure here just shows my earnings, £63,322 and £42,488 for a combined total of 105 k uh, which is just over about $120. And the screenshots here of me earning 11949 So this is all for consultancy services. These are also for uh, com commission-based revenues that I generated. Uh, throughout my consultancy career in the three months that I was just completely ramming it. Uh, some more deposits here as well. So screenshots, uh, these screenshots show me earning 11,209 in three payments. So we had a three payment split there. This is like, you know, 20, 20, 22 K there. Uh, we got 105 K there. So we're just a little bit over 150 K um, as well. So I'm going to be showing you guys some more screenshots about my customers, uh, what kind of results they've experienced as well uh, through leveraging the, the models and the, and the frameworks and the strategies that I'm going to be showing you inside this training. Super excited to get underway with that. But as I mentioned, I did this without referral, inbound leads, competing on the uh, on prices, guarantees or irresistible offers. And this was strictly for consulting other large B2B firms, uh, seven to nine figure firms that I was working with. And I'm going to get into all of that as well. So keep watching and uh, let's get into it. So couple of screenshots from my customers. The screenshot here just shows my customer Yusuf making 16K a month in his first 23 days with his consultancy. As you can see, he closed an NFC client uh, for 5K up front and a percentage of profits deal. And he was running a new growth consultancy offer as well, uh, which I helped him set up. And he ha hit 16K a month inside his first 23 days with me. So huge. Here's another screenshot just showing my customer Ilio making 12 thousand one hundred and forty one dollars with his consultancy in 35 days super excited to be working with this guy he he works really hard he just closed in 5.4k deals over the weekend and here you can see you know let's only count cash collected in your hands so basically 10k in 30 days 12 one for one actually that's his first 10k over 10k months since starting the agency another screenshot just shows my customer nevis hitting his first 10k month inside so 2k closed pretty much this week and he just hit 10k month so that's huge for him and another screenshot this was a big big one. So uh, one of my customers, Jack, secured a $9,000 a month deal with BitMEX, which is a trillion dollar company uh, in, the, in, the, in the blockchain niche. So as you can see here, the screenshot he messaged me was, yeah, we closed BitMEX. I think we got some more in the pipe. I asked him about the deal size, like, yeah, it's 9K, but this guy's obviously calling it quite small, which it is actually. So, so before we dive any deeper, you've seen some screenshots here, you know, we've got 10K here, 9K a month deal. You know, another 12K here, another 16K a month deal. You've seen all the screenshots here. Now it's just time to get into exactly what the purpose of this training is and how I'm going to be presenting this information to you. So the main purpose of this training is to share insights directly from my consultancy experiences to help agency owners, freelancers and B2B service providers fill their calendar with high intent calls and charge premium prices upwards of 10K a month. So if you're not any of the above I mentioned, if you're not like a, a consultant, or agency owner or freelancer or B2B service provider, then just uh, just please close this page, it's not for you. And let's get into it. So, many founders fail within the first year, not due to lack of motivation, but because they overlook essential business fundamentals and build on shaky ground instead of a solid foundation. I personally experienced this setback before realizing my mistakes. If we haven't met yet, my name is Kai Cabero. In 2019, I was broke and on the brink of homelessness. So. As you can see here is a really nice screenshot of my bank account balance at 31 pence, which is like fucking nothing, uh, highlighting my challenging financial situation at the time. So again, in 2019, this was me back then. A lot has changed, as you can see. I may have seemed smiling, but behind it, I was struggling. Despite having nothing in my bank account, I found myself drinking almost every night and that smile masked the pain of my situation. So this is actually a pretty tough time for me. I was just drinking like Monday to Saturday, not even and even the Sunday, to be honest, turning up to work drunk and just whatever job I could hold down at that time. So it was just a period of, of it was just a downhill spiral. And I didn't have the most successful upbringing, shall I say the least, but you know, I wasn't born into wealth. My lower class upbringing included debt and loan sharks at my door daily. So financial stability as a kid wasn't a familiar concept. I left school at 15 with poor grades, 
and jumped into various jobs. You know, I did hospitality, uh, fitness coaching, sales, business development, and recruitment as well. Uh, I had a lot of fun in, in the fitness side of things, sales and, and biz dev, and recruitment was a great industry to be in. So despite all the setbacks, I still had uh, some promising uh, career opportunities here. And then the pandemic hit uh, in 2020 and I quit my job with no savings and hit rock bottom, right? So I was really desperate. I tried the typical routes like drop shipping, SMMA without much success. Like I just, I just felt like I wanted to do something online and I didn't want to work for anyone ever again. Uh, the recruitment space was good, for example, but I was in working in a really toxic environment, wasn't getting paid what I was deserved. Um, I was performing really well uh, as well in that position. So, but yeah, I just didn't really want to work for anyone else because I just realized like, hey, you know what? Um, you lot are turning up in uh, better cars every single month or every single quarter and I'm, I'm just stuck with the bag, you know? So I decided to take matters into my own hands, but yeah, I just, I just quit without any, uh, any safety net really. So I had still had nothing really to my name because I just spent it all on, on alcohol and shit. Um, but anyway, so, um, like I mentioned, I, I, I tried the typical routes like drop shipping, SMA, uh, and then I stumbled on something called outbound marketing. Okay. And that was turning cold strangers into paying customers, which aligned with my sales and business development background. And I signed my first client for $600, $600 and it felt like I'd made it right. That first deposit hit in my account. I was like, wow, this is, this is, you know, this is where it all goes up from here. So unfortunately I couldn't deliver results and ended up refunding him. Okay. It was a web design offer and it was, it was just a challenge for me to get any meetings for him or get any calls booked. So, you know, I just refunded the guy. I was like, look, let's not work on this anymore. Uh, and this setback just simply fueled my determination to improve. Okay. So I locked myself in, um, and intensely focused on honing my skills and fast forward to October, 2022, I joined a UK tech startup called GVM as part of their business development team. So it practically became my first official client. Um, I secured a hundred demos for them in our first quarter, overcoming common challenges like unqualified meetings and just simple lack of sales process. And here's a GIF showcasing over a hundred demos booked on their Calendly in Q1 uh, 2023. That's when we really started kicking off the project. I used the period October, November, December, like the last quarter to just really just set all the systems up and um, just get to really understanding their offer and their value proposition and just hitting, hitting Q1 2023 with just a big bang. They've never, they had never seen anything like that before. So yeah, as I can see, the GIF is running right now. So you can see all the meetings there. Um, <clears throat> and then here we've got some really cool screenshots, you know, Cameron, uh, which is the uh, biz dev manager um, that I was working alongside at the company. Uh, he's closing a deal with Oasis X, which is a $1 million funded startup. Um, screenshot uh, shows Cameron securing a meeting with Magic Eden, $96 million uh, revenue company. And he's also secured a dinner with Rarible, which is uh, funded 16 million as well. So all of these companies, you know, there's over like 100, 100 million there. Um, so very good first quarter. And they even flew me out to Web Summit in Lisbon which is one of the biggest tech conferences in the world. Uh, all expenses paid, of course, and uh, that's just a picture of us all together. So what I did afterwards, I had these like really uh, big results with these guys. I, I documented the entire process and I began showcasing these results to more potential clients, right? And the outcome was incredible. And in just 92 days, my strategy yielded 150K in client contracts and performance-based commissions. So after the first quarter of them, like these are, these are my results. Like you can see, uh, you know, after the first quarter, we had like 5k, 15k, 13k, 14k, 17k. We worked, we were working together for like a year, um, just over a year. And you can see all the, all the screenshots here. There's like another 34k in, in profit there. And all these, uh, deposits hit in my account. Then we had a big, big year. That was like the biggest transition of my life. So the screenshots here, payments over 150k and received, which were received for consulting and revenue share building the systems, deploying the systems, running and managing the systems, it was great. So I'll be really honest, like I'm not here to flex or impress you. There's other people in the space that are doing just more ridiculous numbers than me, but this is this is my personal journey. This is what I've done to get results. And you know, this is what I'm showing you today in this training. So like I mentioned, just again, I don't share this to flex or impress you, but I made over 150K. I traveled to over 25 countries. I shopped at luxury stores like Louis Vuitton and even bought a house in the UK while running my dream business. So as you can see, here's a house that I purchased and you know, me and my wife over here in Milan, we traveled some really nice places, had some really nice dinners. 
Uh, and I started sharing my results on Twitter and YouTube and began receiving DMs asking for help to build a consultancy using the model I had developed, okay? So here's a couple of screenshots of just people asking me, like, how does it work? How do, you know, how can I get involved? They started seeing all my results that I was posting. They were like, wow, you know, let's, let's get into this. I want these kind of results myself. I've seen you all over socials for a while. Curious to see what this consulting thing has to offer. Uh, I want to start, where shall I start? Having problem getting with getting clients, can I help? Uh, can you help me? And to validate the demand, like more so, obviously, you know, maybe maybe 10, five to 10 inquiries a week inbound from this stuff. Um, but I just wanted to validate that model further, right? So I began DMing people to set up what I call an insight exchange. So in this exchange, right, I asked them a series of questions about their business and challenges for research purposes. And in return, they can ask me anything about business development, outbound marketing, stuff like that, right? Here's a call of that. Um, here's a screenshot of that. So after about 30 calls, um, I developed a small one-on-one -on -one consulting offer to help people solve client acquisition without needing lots of followers or relying on guarantees or irresistible offers. And signing up one client simply led to another, okay? And now I have over 10 coaching clients in just two months. I turned this idea into a 14K a month business, $17K, by documenting the entire process online. I was simply monetizing an idea I had and in the process built another 168K a year business. This is on top of my done for you stuff. So that boutique uh, done for you stuff that I do at a high level and then obviously the done with you program. So a lot of fucking rep is coming in uh, in that sense. So here's a couple of screenshots uh, of active private students in, in my Slack channel and uh, a Stripe dashboard showing 14K uh, gross. So here is what you've been waiting for. So you've seen all the results, you've seen, you know, you know a little bit more about me and my journey, what I've been through, you know, being here, borderline, just poor as fuck. Um, and then just changing everything over by just locking in, dialing in and doing the work really, just researching, you know, direct response copy, outbound, all these different things, sales, I was improving my sales skills, which has got really some really good great results. So this is the training outline. This is exactly what I'm gonna be showing you right now, exactly how I earned 158K in three months, charging 10 to 30K fees with less than 500 followers. Keep reading to learn exactly, or keep watching in this case to learn exactly how to do this. I'm just gonna go through these five steps. Okay, and this isn't everything. I'm gonna get like I'm gonna get into that. Like, you can see how how in depth I go for, uh, for you guys. But first things first, I just need to, uh, you to understand these five steps. Okay, and they're really short bullet points to just dive in. So step one is cultivate a winning mindset. Obviously, when you if, if you're in a similar position or if you're already at like you know 20, 30, 40, 50 k, even 100 k. Some of the guys in the program are at 50 to 100. If you are beginning or even if you're more advanced, you must have a winning mindset. It's just, you need it, okay? Embrace abundance and confidence, right? Project professionalism through high quality experiences with people, show confidence in all interactions and treat others with respect and kindness. Treat the janitor the same way you treat the CEO. Everyone is on a level, okay? Step two is target the right niche. Focus on clients with financial stability, avoid businesses in survival mode, Identify industries lagging in modern marketing or sales or infrastructure or systems, okay? These three are critical. And you can also even go along the size of the uh, the industry as well. So make sure the total addressable market is big enough uh, for you to operate in, okay? Step three is find your expertise. So leverage your experience and skills. Deep understanding of these industries gives you a competitive edge. Focus on niches like pharma, technology, blockchain, etc. And the reason I say that is because the agencies selling to agency owners, the workshop guys selling workshops, like how to sell workshops to people that want to learn how to do workshops, like the bubble is going to pop. Servicing premium, high quality, seven to nine, seven to ten figure companies is what's going to help you build a real sustainable business for the future and really, you know, just light your life on fire. Okay, you're going to have so much freedom, you're going to have so much time, you're going to work with great clients. And following these steps and this uh, training is, is going to help you do exactly that. So let's continue. So step four is delivering value. And uh, you need to address the specific needs and pain points of your market, modernize sales processes and funnels, and provide expertise and training for performance improvement. Okay, so find out what keeps your market up at night. What, what is the biggest challenge that you can solve in their business? Deep understanding of exactly what, how they use their language, how they speak to each other, how they communicate, how they do deals sales cycles, make sure you're modernizing the sales process and funnels, right? So for example, some of these companies, like I mentioned, pharma, tech, blockchain, they don't have any infrastructure in place. They don't have any systems in place. It's 
very easy for someone to come along and fix those things up for them, okay? And you can provide your expertise and training and train their teams uh, for performance improvement as well. So if their close ratios are poor, you can come in, consult and help them on how to raise that because the kind of people that are more suited for this kind of stuff as you know beginners can can use this model right I'm, I, I was i was a beginner and i leveraged this model because I, I put in the work and i learned and studied and just made it an obsession and if you even you know it's more suited for people that have one to two case studies because you can leverage those in the market way quicker you know there's only a couple more levers that you need to pull than a beginner coming in starting from scratch that said i've worked with people in the past and got them 20 calls in 21 days as a complete beginner a couple of the guys in here have got uh, you know, they've gone from zero to 16K a month in 23 days. So it can be done. You just need to fucking work hard, okay? So uh, step five is building long-term success. Expand services beyond, beyond your initial offerings, okay? So don't be uh, static. Be, you know, more modular, a bit more flexible in your approach. If Just sell what the, the prospect is telling you they want to buy and use case studies and client success stories as leverage and establish yourself as an in-demand consultant. So bonus tip as well, strategic positioning. Um, I'll go into a bit more depth about all this stuff, but you know, you differentiate yourself from commoditized agencies, right? You don't look like everyone else, so you can charge more. Offer agility and superior results, speed of delivery, making sure they get really good results, premium experience, and make clients happy for lifelong partnerships. You want to be working with people for a year, two years, three years, 10 years, 20 years. You know, you don't want to be scrambling for clients every other month because your churn rate is so high and you can't really fucking deliver. So ditch the one-time services and start expanding your horizons with that yeah and i get asked this a lot but sales calls yes or no and my answer to stuff like this is always it depends okay so i've closed deals with one call two calls even four calls and you know what i've also closed deals with just a simple google doc and a stripe link right just in the dms but it depends on the client and the level of prep needed to close the deal so for example uh, a prospect found my solution through one of my youtube videos if you don't know me already, I have, have some YouTube videos uh, available that talk about these various different topics and you can check that after, but they were eager to connect. So I shared a direct link to book a discovery call after my Calendly link had an issue, right? So you can see here, um, we were locked in the call. And then after the call, I promised to send a Google doc just outlining. This was after the, this is the initial discovery call. Uh, we go through something, what I call a triage ask them a bunch of questions about their business, like where they're at, where they want to be, six, 12 month goal, uh, revenue size, all that kind of stuff. What's the bottlenecks? What's stopping you from getting there, etc. Uh, after the call, after I digested all that information, I went away and I promised to send them a Google doc just outlining strategy, ramp up time, deliverables, their input, investment details, stuff like that. And then this eliminated the need for another sales call or any further back and forth, like literally zero objection handling, nothing. Nothing was actually required because I just answered everything in the doc and I did such a quality uh, triage call that I had everything I needed to turn this into a sale, into, into a paid in full, right? So I positioned the next step as an onboarding call to streamline the process and capitalize on momentum. So I didn't have a sales call at all. I just said, look, this next call is gonna be an onboarding call. I'm gonna send you a doc in between that and we're just gonna go through that together on the call. Does that make sense? And then he, we, we went through it. So within hours, we scheduled the onboarding, signed the agreement and received payment, a tidy 9250 USD for a small implementation build and consulting. So we set up all this stuff for him. As you can see, this was the, the contract layout. Uh, and this wasn't your typical done for you service. It was more of like a create and deliver model. So first you develop the customized infra, whether it's outbound content acquisition, video or hiring systems for your client, okay? Then comes the deliver phase. So you hand off the infrastructure along with guides, SOPs and training so their team can manage it independently. And then you just repeat this process for each client. You just streamline fulfillment, increase upfront revenue, sales and scale delivery efficiently. And then another success came from nurturing a warm lead for six months, uh, resulting in a hefty $30,000 deal. I followed the same playbook as with the 9K deal. I mapped out their goals and ideal transformation. I presented everything clearly in a Google doc. Uh, I sent over the paperwork and agreement terms and a reinforced credibility with client testimonials. So you can see two 15K, uh, this is the, the contract out, outline and scope. Total fees 30K, 15 on receipt, 15K at the end of delivery. And to succeed in consultancy, you need solid client results, trust, transparency, and industry authority. Those three things are crucial. So leveraged all my previous results, said like, hey, we, we did this for these guys. You know, we could do the same for you. Let's just map it out and, and you know, lock it in and get, and get going. So 
this is the modular approach and this is like me going deeper into the training like you know we're going to go real deep guys so let's get into it so rigidly sticking to offerings can cost clients what that means is if you are static with your offering, right? You just sell this one thing to this one person. Yeah, okay, great. But when people are telling you on the call that they may have not just that one problem you solve, but they've got a bunch of other problems you solve, you can charge for all of those problems, whether it's up and down the pricing ladder, okay? Effective sales and marketing involve listening to prospects' pain points and offering tailored solutions, okay? It's not a one size fits all because modular flexibility allows you to adjust offers based on client needs and you can maximize your revenue potential. Okay, so a 10K deal or a 5K deal could turn into a 30, 40, 50, 75K deal in some cases, okay? And how you elevate your value is simple. Consultants go beyond delivering results. They enhance client reputation and decision makers credibility. Basically, we make them look good in front of their peers, in front of their market. We position them as a thought leader and authority and establish that for them. Transitioning from agency owner to consultant involves leveraging experience and results to position as highly valuable and highly leveraged. Irresistible offers. So you've heard it all before from your favorite bearded flannel wearing guru, uh, irresistible offers. You've probably read the book as well, but unlike agency owners competing for clients, consultants rely on reputation only. So, and expertise rather than irresistible offers and other gimmicks, okay? Build genuine professional relationships through content, personal brand and messaging before pursuing sales. You can sell, but it helps you leverage your every, like your entire being, your entire everything you are inside the consultant is leveraged through personal brand, certified relationships and connections with your peers, your market, your industry. You need to be seen as a valuable person, okay? That can solve all their problems. So positioning against common threats. So aligning with prospects against common threats builds trust and differentiation from competitors. Consultants simply tackle industry challenges collaboratively fostering deep market trust. So it's never you and the client versus each other. It's you and the prospect or the client versus the challenge. You need to slay the dragon together, okay? And logic versus emotion in sales. So base sales arguments on logic only while appealing to emotional gains like status and material success for decision makers. Understanding decision making. So navigating decision making layers require nurturing relationships with key decision makers and maintaining a stellar reputation the whole way through and how you expand the strategy for higher ticket deals. You just simply anticipate longer approval processes because once you get up in the, up, you know, up in the playing fields, up the ranks in, in, in the industry or the market you're in, you will experience longer approval processes. There may be one or two characters or one or two big players that are more involved in that process. And then you need like a fight or side off, right? That's why you need to have a good relationship with maybe one or two people and they can act as champions in between the business, just saying your good praises. Um, and then that will make in turn them look good when uh, you get great results for them, right? So uh, delivering consistent value and expanding relationships post success are pivotal for long term client retention and growth, because if you make them look good for a long period of time, you're going to get paid good, right? So here's a streamlined version of steps two to five for building and scaling a consultancy business. First things first, construct client acquisition assets. Okay, build a loyal following on X, LinkedIn and YouTube, create content addressing audience interests and challenges to establish credibility. Direct follows to a newsletter or DMs to uncover pain points and propose solutions. Step three is fill the calendar with qualified calls. Leverage audience and content for outreach. Develop strategic outbound infrastructure, cold email, DMs, cold calling. Personalize outreach to highlight unique value props aligned with their pain points, okay? Step four, scaling sales and staying lean. Establish a structured sales process using Google Docs. Implement an appointment setting system. Consider hiring sales reps to scale operations and build a scalable sales system combining setters and reps for efficiency. Okay, you can still keep this very lean. I'm not talking about building a 10 man team. I'm talking about building a sustainable, scalable sales team or system which combines setters and reps. You probably need like two or three people. One is also good. I operate with one uh, and it's very good. So step five, productizing. Ensure your market and model can scale effectively. Automate the delivery of your consultancy model. And like I mentioned, hire one to two operators to manage operations and explore paid traffic channels once you've already hit, you know, you've added another 30K MRR or something like that. You can just reinvest that back into ads and take that further. So these steps simply provide a clear pathway to establish, expand and automate your consultancy business while maintaining a lean and scalable approach. So keep reading for an exploded view of the model. And I'll just take another zip here because we've got a lot to cover. So step one, product market fit, right? 
Simply choose a market where you have experience or proven results. This familiarity helps you understand their critical pain points. If you're unsure, research industries you're familiar with or passionate about. Talk to industry professionals to grasp their challenges and goals as explained in this video here. Basically, this is a product market fit call where I simply go over the way to get these people on a call so that you can validate their problems and then simply just use their feedback to drive your product development, service development forward and just sell them what they want, okay? And also, you also build up a nice pipeline because then you can go away and later and say, come back and be like, hey, you know what? I've got this offer now, solving all these problems. Let's talk about it, get a deal done. So like I mentioned here, you can validate the problem. You can use this for any service B2B in the market, uh, validate the problem by signing two to five beta clients, offer them discounted services in exchange for feedback and case studies. Once you've validated that, develop a proof of concept that delivers the desired result or transformation. Ensure client satisfaction before moving forward, create standard operating procedures, SOPs, which is just documents going over your process, and then just make sure you maintain consistent delivery of the service, okay? This should say step two, but yeah, it is what it is. Construct client acquisition assets. So I just go deeper on these points here, okay? Focus on building an organic audience on platforms like X, LinkedIn, and YouTube. Engage with your niche daily and then direct them to a newsletter or a landing page featuring a video sales letter, much like this, explaining your value proposition. So this is your value proposition slash validation stage, okay? After you've done all that and you've got the feedback you need, you start constructing client acquisition assets, okay? Because you've got a validated model now, okay? And people have paid for it, yep. So here's just a couple of client acquisition assets you can create, video sales letter, client interview, you can just you know watch those here. Craft a content schedule that includes valuable insights, personal stories, actionable content uh, to nurture your audience and some content guidelines. So X is one to three tweets per day, one to two long form posts per day and three videos per week. LinkedIn, three to five long form per week. YouTube is one to three long form videos per week. You just need to pump content pump results, pump case studies, pump proof to the market. When they land on your landing page, when they see you from a cold DM or cold email, they will look you up 99.9% .9 of the time. And they will just be like, who the hell is this guy trying to sell me something? Oh wait, he's actually got loads of credibility. He's worked with so many people and he's become an authority in his niche or industry. Bet, let's get on a call. You know, let's work with him, right? Or her. So. These strategies will help in audience engagement and lead generation effectively. And then step three is, like I mentioned, fill your calendar with qualified calls, right? The fun part. So leverage your audience and content to generate book calls. Incorporate strong calls to action CTAs in your content to prompt prospects to schedule consultations. Obviously, cold email and all that kind of stuff. We're going to set this up in a minute as well. Um, implement a direct messaging system to initiate convos with potential clients and guide them towards scheduling calls and explore outbound prospecting strategies such as cold email to broaden your reach and generate leads. And here's just a simple outbound message that I've used with success. Uh, I came across your profile while researching niche companies. You just put in the type of industry that you're in here. Recently, I helped a client, this is your case study, which achieved this result in just this time frame. Would you be interested in seeing a quick case study? Once they uh, respond yes, then hit them back with the case study and then follow up accordingly to see if it was relevant and then book in the call or if they're asking more information, just send them that as well. And step four is simply scaling and staying lean. So establish a clear and structured sales process to and script to guide prospect through the sales funnel. Implement an appointment setter tool to qualify leads and efficiently schedule calls, allowing you to focus on delivering value and then gradually scale your sales team by hiring and training sales reps to manage inbound leads and conduct effective sales consultations. So team grows, you go, you still, you grow, you're still staying lean. Profits are really high. You're good. Continuously optimize your sales systems using performance metrics and feedback to enhance efficiency and effectiveness. And as your personal brand starts to gain traction, like the snowball effect happens, right? So consider just reducing your direct involvement in sales, uh, the sales calls specifically, and transition to outsourcing sales rep, uh, responsibilities to trained reps or appointment setters, leveraging methods like the Google Doc for streamlined sales processes. So step five, simply productizing and just adding more fuel to the fire right? This is a really good place to be in. This is super fun. You're scaling now. You're staying lean. Profit margins are high. You've got cold outbound running. You've got inbound acquisition running. You've got one to two operators handling your day-to-day. -day. Um, you're in a really good place right now. So you need to ensure your offer is scalable now, okay? 
And then you just do that by assessing more market demand and refining your business model for maximum efficiency. Because let's face it, your version one offer or model is never gonna be your version 10. You just have to quickly and rapidly adapt based on what client feedback you're getting. Maybe this works better, maybe another model works better, but just keep, keep building and iterating your product. Automate delivery processes wherever feasible. Uh, this will help you streamline ops and minimize manual work. Strategic hiring should address team gaps, allowing effective delegation of tasks to optimize productivity. And you can increase traffic flow through both organic and paid channels to broaden your reach and generate a steady flow of leads. Okay, so, you know, Facebook ads, uh, Google ads, SEO, you can look at other paid channels, you can look at Instagram ads, you can look at all of those traffic systems as well. And then obviously you've got your organic inbound uh, acquisition system and the cold running as well. So super important. Um, you've just got this big like machine running a lean uh, high profit margin as well. So you can focus relentlessly on eliminating, eliminating inefficiencies, automating processes and delegating tasks to facilitate scalable growth for your business. So the steps outlined provide a clear roadmap for securing premium deals as a highly sought after consultant. You have the option to navigate this path independently, which may involve significant trial and error over a year or more. So this is not easy, right? All this stuff, is intermediate to advanced, right? All of this stuff, and it's challenging, okay? So, as you can see, here's what you need to do. Crack product market fit, align your offer and market needs with market needs to attract higher paying clients. Create acquisition assets, you build a strong online presence and content strategy to showcase your expertise. <clears throat> Fill your calendar with calls, use strategic outreach and marketing to schedule consultations, and then scale while staying lean. So. Optimize operations on automate processes to handle growth effective, efficiently, and then productize your solution. Okay, so develop scalable services and systems to deliver consistent value. To achieve signing $10,000 plus clients in the next 19 to 120 days without relying on referrals, inbound leads, competing on price, guarantees, irresistible offers, you, you have a few options to make this happen, right? So option one involves attempting to navigate this process independently or hiring an agency. However, this often results in low quality leads, misunderstanding your value proposition and potential clients who cannot afford your services, AKA you're just gonna be wasting time. Alternatively, you can choose to work directly with me. By doing so, you'll accelerate your journey, achieving faster results with fewer mistakes. And with my guidance, you can expect to sign clients within 90 to 120 days and quickly scale your revenue past $30,000 per month. This approach leverages my proven systems, frameworks, and strategies to ensure your success in attracting and retaining high value clients. Now, if you're already at 30K a month, this will at least add 30K MRR minimum to your bottom line in 90 to 120 days. So if you're at 50, you'll get to 80. If you're 80, you'll get to 110. It's just adding all these systems, keeping everything lean, keeping profit margins high, and you will crack this, okay? So you'll gain access to my precise systems, protocols, frameworks, and strategies designed specifically for selecting optimal markets and establishing your position as a consultant. This method minimizes dependence on guarantees or generic offers, thereby reducing competition, maximizing the value you deliver to your clients, okay? As I mentioned before, this opportunity is ideal for agency owners, freelancers, and B2B service providers aiming to scale their businesses, but encountering challenges such as deal flow bottlenecks, low quality clients, and price competition. So it's worth noting that over 20 business owners have successfully employed this model to achieve outstanding results. We've got Lorenzo who runs a content agency. Before working with me, he was at 15K a month, Q1 2023. After in Q1 2024, he made 50K in 90 days. And you can see the interview directly on YouTube here. Yusuf, who has a growth consultancy, uh, before he was at zero dollars and zero meetings, he hit 16K a month and six new clients in 23 days. You can see the video here. Ilio is a web designer. He's got a web design consultancy. He was at 2K a month before meeting me. After he was at 14K a month and it took him just 35 days. You can see the interview there as well. Jack, who has a marketing and PR consultancy. Uh, before he was just getting pure quali uh, poor quality meetings, just total trash in his calendar. After we installed the systems and all the frameworks and strategies and he closed a 120K contract with a $1 trillion company and smashed 30 high intent calls as well. And he did that in 33 days. So you can see the uh, interview and the case study there as well. <clears throat> so we had Cameron who runs a SaaS, one to two meetings uh, a month. This is a B2B SaaS. 
After working with me, we crushed 100 high intent calls and signed Rarible, which is a $10 million a year company. We did that in 120 days, and you can see the case study there. Chris, who also has a SaaS in Web3, he's ex Coinbase, and he had zero calls before working with me. And just after in you know nine days, we had 22 calls and he closed five deals in nine days. So you can see the interview there as well. So we also had Adam, who's a growth consultant. Before working with me, he had one to two calls per week. And afterwards, he closed 36K contract and eight calls on his calendar in just three days. So as you can see here, he had a 3K a month contract confirmed. So we'll chat to you next week about getting a setter in place. And obviously now he's happy to start scaling. So now that you've seen all these, you know, 15 to 50K a month, in 90 days, six, zero to 16K and six new clients in 23, 2K to 14K a month in 35 days. Jack went from poor quality meetings, trash on the calendars, or 120K signed in 33 days. Cameron, one to two meetings to 100 high intent calls and signed a $10 million a year client in 120. Ex Coinbase, Chris, he uh, went from zero calls to 22 calls in nine days and closed five deals. Adam, one to two calls per week and closed 36K contract and eight calls. So here's exactly what's going to happen when you work with me. Okay. So you will be able to generate leads at a rate you've never seen before. We're going to fill that calendar. Okay. We're going to get product market fit. We're going to validate everything and we're going to work on this together. And we're just going to fill the calendar like at a rate you've never seen before with everything we're going to build together. You will be able to close at over 20%. We're going to help you improve your close rates to at least 30. So out of every 10 calls you have, you're going to close three. If you're selling at five to 10 K plus, you know, 20 K plus, however much your service is, 30, 40 K there. Okay. You can get to $1 million in 12 months. Only if you execute properly, you will be able to sign $10,000 clients without price objections or many sales calls. The market will finally see you as a competent, trustworthy advisor rather than another commoditized agency owner. You can build a sustainable business and live a life of freedom without worrying about where your next client is coming from by working with someone who has actually achieved what you want to do. Okay. And you're going to feel empowered, confident, and motivated to push past your physical and mental boundaries. So by now, you might be wondering how this works. Previously, acquiring clients meant writing lots of content or relying on referrals. Now you can set up a system that consistently fills your calendar with high quality calls automatically, removing the stress of finding your next client. So before you struggled to charge what you're worth and attract top tier clients, but now you can position yourself as a premium solution, commanding fees upwards of 10K per client and simplify your scaling efforts. But doing this alone would take hundreds of hours and tens of thousands of dollars. This program costs just a tenth of that, right? So here's what you get. Onboarding call with me, we'll start with a one-to-one -one call to gather insights and map out your business audit, valued at $1,000. Pricing strategy and market proposition, together we'll define your pricing strategy and craft a compelling market proposition, valued at 950. Success stories, We'll transform your best client results into persuasive success stories that showcase your achievements. This is valued at $1,000. Sales pitch and VSL. This is the fun stuff as well. One of my favorites to build. Using your results and case studies, I'll craft a compelling sales pitch and provide guidance and frameworks for a high converting video sales letter, much like this one, that will do 80% of the selling for you. This is valued at $10,000. Okay, I charge 10K for this. Acquisition setup, I'll assist you in setting up a dual outbounded inbound acquisition engine to drive high intent leads to your business valued at 15K. Personalized support, so you'll join daily and private one-to-one -one calls. We normally have the group calls Wednesday to Friday, uh, 2 p.m. GMT or 6 p.m. GMT. We can also do them earlier as well, but every single week you get one private one-to-one -one call on me to work on your roadmap to get you to the next stage to add you know, 20 to 30K MRR to your business to help you close 10K clients, to help you set up all these infrastructures, right? And it's basically here to help you break through plateaus fast, which is priceless, right? You get access to so much. And then <clears throat> you've got sales assets and content. So you can start generating valuable sales assets and content that attracts seven to nine figure companies with ease with my proven guide, swipe files. This saves you time and effort in the process. This is valued at 100K easily. So we tally this up this is about 126,950, and instead of paying all that i'm offering this to you for only 4750 for six months access and after six months you can continue at 300 bucks a week and then all you need to do is just book a call right here so a little warning though i have limited capacity and can only accept 10 new members per quarter once these spots are filled enrollment into the program will be closed until the next quarter 
This ensures that each member receives the attention and support they need to succeed. Every quarter, I do increase the price as well. It could be by 500, it could be a grand, it could be two or three or five, just depending on demand and how much time I can allocate. So all you need to do, if all of this sounds cool to you and you're ready to get started, or you just wanna find out a little bit more information, but you're really ready to scale your business, add 30K MRR, sign high premium quality clients, no longer be a commodity in the market and actually build a business with real enterprise value and you don't have to sell to other agency owners or marketing agency owners, you can just work with seven to nine figure companies, then simply just book a call right here. Okay, hit that button. But because you made it to the end of this training and you're watching this video, I'm gonna do something extremely special for you. For a limited time, I'm gonna offer an additional private one-to-one -one coaching session per week. So you don't get one, just one call, you get two, right? Valued at $750. And I'm gonna give you 5,000 leads to kickstart your campaigns valued at $500. So you get over a grand worth of free resources included just for getting involved. Okay, so let's summarize this offer. You get an onboarding call valued at a thousand. We'll start with a one-on-one -on -one call to map out your business audit. This alone is just so priceless. Pricing strategy and market prop, we're gonna define that for you, craft a compelling market proposition for you. Success stories, we're gonna take your best client results into persuasive success stories that showcase your achievements. We're gonna build you a high converting video sales letter that will do 80% of the selling for you. It pre-educates and pre-nurtures your prospects before you get on the call, increasing your chance of closing. And we're going to set that all up for you as well. So, and then we're going to set up the acquisition system, the dual outbound and inbound acquisition engine to drive high intent leads to your business. I charge 15K plus for this, like on its own. Okay. And then obviously the personalized support. And now you get two one-on-one -on -one calls with me every single week and then sales assets and content. So huge. All the stuff that I've used to attract all these big firms with a very small following. Like I've got less than 500 followers on X, 1200 subscribers on YouTube. I mean, you don't really need that. I was still closing deals on, on X alone, five figure deals with like 300 followers. So you can do it. You don't need a big 10K following. Like you just don't need it, right? You just need competence, okay? So, and as I mentioned, additional private one-on-one -on -one coaching sesh per week, every week with me and give you 5,000 leads to kickstart your campaigns, right? Just like highly qualified leads, um, pre-vetted. You've got all their information, name, number, email, like if they've hi got hiring intent, all that good stuff based on your industry. Again, just to note that I have limited capacity and I can only accept 10 new members per quarter. So once these spots are filled, guys, enrollment into the program will be closed until the next quarter. So if you join uh, in July or if you jo join in August, for example, uh, if you hit the button right now, if you join this month, the next quarter, once these spots are filled, they're just completely gone. You, ca you can't come back in, okay? Sorry, you can't get a seat, right? This ensures that each member receives the attention and support they need to succeed. If you're ready to work with me, click right here to book a call or somewhere around this video, this may uh, this is gonna go on YouTube as well, so you can hit the link in the description below. But for those reading this document, uh, you can just hit the button right there and book a call with me. And I hope you enjoyed this training as much as I enjoyed delivering it, but I will talk with you soon. I will see you inside the program. And if you're reading this, uh, you can just scroll through the questions and answers, uh, the FAQ section as well. I go over, can my team join with me? You know, it's having PMF a must, like all of the questions you have want answered are there. And you can also go to uh, basedconsulting.co.uk and I go through everything here as well and you can see all of the results. This is June 2024, so we're only accepting three new members in June right now. Uh, prices will raise in July. And you've got Yusuf there, Lorenzo, 50K in 90 days, Elio, 14K a month in 35 days. We've got uh, some high intent calls, 120K whale client for Jack. This is a cool one. This is recent. So Anthony generated 15 high intent calls. Uh, in nine days for a short form content agency, 22K added to pipe. He was really struggling beforehand. Uh, this is an SEO freelancer, went from zero to three and a half K in three weeks without case studies or sales experience. He's super happy of everything. And I just go into a bit more detail about what we were talking about earlier, my personal story, like how I grew, how I got flown out and all these results that I got, how the model came to be, what exactly you get included. Everything is here, what we pretty much discussed. You're so close to signing 10K plus clients, guys. If you've got this far to the end of this video, you need to book a call and we will chat on the other side. There's more wins. We had another close and then a T client, 5K a month. We had Cameron booking 100, 100 meetings in 120 days. We had seven and a half K payments for one of, one of the guys inside. This one was massive, 45K in seven days. Huge, huge results. And if you've got any questions or answers, you can just go straight to baseconsulting.co.uk and I will see you inside. Cheers.